What's up, people? This is Skip Jenkins on the Skip Goes Hard Binky 83 channel, the most underrated, never duplicated sneaker YouTuber in the game. It is I, your boy Skip Jenkins, in this bitch, February 11, 2017. I checked my sneakers app because I want to find out the status of my LeBron 14s that I got off the sneakers app. Shout out to Nike. Shout out for you making for you all making a lovely, lovely looking ass shoe. The bitches go hard in my opinion, accurate opinion. So I'm going through the feed and I see that uh the Air Jordan take I see, the Air Jordan 5 take flights. Them bitches sold out. I scroll up. I see the Air Jordan 1 Black History Months. They sold out. I'm like, shit, that's two for two. Then I'm looking at the Jordan Truner LX Black History Month. Sold out. All three of them bitches sold out today. I'm like, hot damn. Wow. Motherfuckers were not playing around Saturday. Shit. Some niggas were like, hey, they couldn't get them Yeezy. So they was like, fuck it. If you, if, if, if you can't beat them, join them. Shit. Because, uh... I'm not gonna lie, I tried to get those Yeezys. And the funny thing about it is, it's not really funny, it's 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 shitty. But uh I had a nine minute head start on the foot action app. So I'm thinking, I'm like shit, I got this shit in the bag, man. Uh and then after the time went down, uh I got put on a wait list. That was new to me. I was like, what's this shit right here? I'm looking at it. Uh so I had to wait, and then I was like, okay, they was like, okay, well, we'll let you know in four hours if you got them shits. And then four hours came by and I didn't get anything. I'm like, damn, man. And then like maybe 30 minutes or an hour later, it said, uh, sorry, you didn't get the Yeezys. Ha ha, ho ass nigga. Uh, try tomorrow. That's what it said. And then of course I woke up early, tried tomorrow and the shit was just, you know, crashed, whatever. So I didn't get the Yeezys. Fuck it. I'll be, I'll be all right. It's not the end of the world. Uh, but yeah, man, the take five, take five, the Air Jordan five take flights, Black History Month ones and the damn Trunners, Trunners like wow because I remember like back in the day Trunners was shit, you know what I mean like niggas you you get some Trunners in a heartbeat. Um, I'm glad to see them out. I mean I haven't seen any Trunners in a long ass time like for sale or maybe maybe I'm under I've been living under a rock. I mean who knows, but uh. The uh the take flight fives, man. They look better than the eights, in my opinion, accurate opinion. Um but damn. First they retail for 190. I was like, you know, when I first saw when I first saw the five, I was like, uh I was like, they look better than the eights, but I'm not really sure. That you know the whole the Call of Duty color and shit. But I was like, I might get them. And then the price jumped from 190 to 400 I was like, hell no, nah, nigga, I'm not <laughs> you're not gonna get me with that stupid shit. No, 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 no. Four hundred, four hundred for a, for a cute box and a little pussy ass bag. Really, really, really. They were like, okay, well, we can't sell them for one ninety because we got this little cute little box. And uh, oh yeah, yeah, hey, 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 throw throw one of them pussy ass uh, bags in the box. Yeah, but let's hike this price up for their ass. And the other dude was like, okay, yeah, we'll do that. So then, bam, retail for $400. $400. Sold out. So you balling ass niggas got the shoe today. You collect their ass niggas got the shoe today. You stupid ass, uh, my, my check engine light has been in my car, been, a uh, light has been on my car for like three years now. Uh, no, no food in the refrigerator. My gas tank is always damn near on E. Motherfuckers also bought the shoe today too. Um, <laughs> that's a damn shame. But that's how it is. I mean, the fives they sold out. That that's, that's that that's that hype. They went ahead. They wait. They gave it a little cute box and threw that pussy ass a uh, little little bag the, the uh for you to. You know, hold the shoes in. They they threw that shit in there, and that was like, hey man, four hundred dollars. Hey, take it or leave it. And motherfuckers like, I'll take it. So I mean, shit. I mean, is are they worth four hundred dollars? No, that they, they could have been at least like two fifty. You know, because you know of, of the box and in the in, in the pussy ass bag. You know what I mean? Like they they could have they they could have retail for two fifty, not four hundred dollars. 
Now I know the uh, you know the materials they use for this for this shoe is you know high quality, high standard, high dollar shit. You know what I mean? But still, four hundred dollars? No. They 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 could have been two fifty, but they were four hundred. They sold out. Good job, Nike. Good job, people at Jordan. Y'all did it again. Uh, Air Jordan Five sold out, which is you know, and it's not even a uh, it's not even a OG colorway. You know what I mean? But that but that box, that cute little box and that pussy ass bag they threw in. I was like, yeah, these motherfuckers, yeah, they gonna sell out, and they sure did. And then this brings us to the uh, Black History Month. Air Jordan ones. Now, like I said, I forgot. I forgot what. I wasn't even up on the Jordan releases that were coming out Saturday because I was still hooked on trying to get a pair of those fucking Yeezys. Struck out. Um, but the the Black History Month Air Jordan ones, they're all right. I don't I don't like any Air Jordan one with a jump man in the back, so that complete that completely. I was like, no, I don't, I, mean, I didn't want them. But I mean, it's a it's a all black, it's an all black Jordan one. I mean, you know what I mean? Like, I have all black Jordan ones with the gum bottom sole. You know what I mean? That I got at the uh, Nike outlets. I mean, it's like they look like the same exact fucking shoe. But the thing is, uh, I believe with the uh, there's like Velcro on the tongue and uh, uh, on the wings on the side and then on the uh, on the swoosh or check as how, how some people call it either swoosh or check I call it swoosh now on the swoosh is all that's Velcro so you can take it off so I know I know that that I know that sold people people are like oh shit man the black history uh month ones man that got the Velcro on them shits man you could take it off I mean shit I mean uh they black history month so I know Martin Luther King Jr. he was wearing them bitches uh when he was in Washington at his uh I have a dream speech I know he had them on you know you dumbass niggas probably thought that and some shit uh <laughs> um but I mean they sold out which is good black history month i wonder like the black history month version shoes do they go to like anything related to like black history you know like black colleges or you know like the money or half the money and not really have motherfuckers are greedy so they're not, they're not gonna put half they'll put like a portion of the uh you know a portion of proceeds go to this and that i wonder if is any of that money gonna go back to you know certain black things i don't know my probably not but you know oh oh well shit um uh, and then you have the air jordan the trunners the trunners they are uh what well, i mean shit here they go there's this not they don't look bad at all I like the colors, the black, the gold, the black, the gold, and the white, the little jump man on the side. Um, I mean, shit. And then you got the bottom of the shoe, you got that gold and that black with the Jordan and gold. You got the other side of the trunners. I mean, I think the like the only reason they sold out because, you know, some people remember trunners being hot back in the day. Um they are the Black History Month, so they're gonna add some different things to it, different colors to them. And I mean, they, I don't they don't even show the damn I mean the price for these bitches. I don't even remember what the price was. The only shoe I know the price of was the uh the take fly the take I can't I want I want, I want to say take fives, fuck. The take flight fives. They were one ninety, then they bumped up to four hundred. I mean, but those are like the only only price. I don't know the price of the Black History Month ones. Nor these trunners, like I said, this weekend. This weekend was kind of dry, in my opinion, accurate opinion. Um, even I, I can even tell. I might, I might even excited by doing this fucking video. To be honest, I'm just like, it's whatever. Uh, next, next weekend, All Star weekend. So you got the, like I said, you got the fucking the thirty ones dropping on Thursday. You got the the sixes on Friday. The Chicago OG thirteens on Saturday. And the Air Jordan 1s on Sunday. Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Back to back to back to back. Jordans, man. That's going to be a busy ass. That's going to be a busy ass weekend. It's going to be crazy. Um, like I said, it's, it's going down. Um, I know I was talking that stupid shit about how I wanted to get the 6s and the 31s. And 
in the OG 13s and the ones and all that. But to be honest, y'all, to, to be honest, my subs, man, I really like what the fuck? Like, am I? This is what I was talking about in my video about. Like, is it worth it to have so many shoes? I I call myself a collector, but do I need the 31s and the sixes and the 13s and the ones? That's like that's four pairs of shoes, and I already know that. I'm not gonna wear any of them. They're just gonna fucking sit. But I'm a collector, so they can't sit. But at the same time, it's like, man, this is more shoes piling up and shit like that. To be honest with you all, real fucking talk. The only ones I need is uh, I need a new pair of 13s, and I need two pairs of the All Star ones. That's mainly it. I only really need the 31s, which they're cool. And the sixes, I mean, they're they're cool too, but I don't really I don't really need them. I need those thirteens, and I need two pairs of Air Jordan ones. That's what I need. That's real talk. Um, but if if I like I said, if y'all see a video on Thursday, with, well, actually, yeah, if I if, like in the future, if you see me with the video, if I post a video and I have the thirty ones and the sixes and the thirteens and the ones, that means I was pretty much like fuck it. The nigga in me was like, hey, nigga, you got to get all the shoes. Fuck what they talking about. Fuck what you're talking about. You got to get them all. And the black person in me is going to be like, man, I told you, Skip, you don't need all these shoes, brother. You don't. But you did it anyway. Enjoy. You know what I mean? But, hey, I don't know. This shit crazy. I'm hungry. <sighs> like I said, it was a dry-ass weekend. The shoes that came out today, I really didn't care about. Uh... But besides that, hey, I'm Skip, I'm Skip Jenkins. This is Skip Goes Hard, Binky83 channel. I am the most underrated, never duplicated sneaker YouTuber in the game. Like this video, leave a comment, share the video, and subscribe to the channel. Ring that bell. So every time I post a pussy ass video, you all will know. And you can watch my ass with these red ass gloves doing what I do. Um... Hey, that's mainly it, y'all. Enjoy y'all Saturday. Wash those asses. If you motherfuckers spend four hundred dollars on them fives, like you know, y'all know what I say. Your, your asses better be clean. They better be clean. You had better not stood in no fucking line, smelling like ass hole. Don't do that. Don't do it. It's not a good look. It's not a good look. That's it. I'm Skip Jenkins. I'm out. Take care. Wash your asses.